all my makeup is in here because I just went on a vacation, not a vacation, a weekend trip with my friend. So I haven't unpacked yet, or unpacked my makeup yet. So I'm just gonna be like scrounging around in here for stuff. I'm gonna use my Chanel BB cream and this, or CC cream, and this isn't the lightest one they have. It doesn't really match my skin, but um, I like to look whiter than I am. Or lighter, whatever, I don't know. Lighter, whiter. time I'll just sit here and like fiddle around with them until I get the shape that I really like. This is a little bit too like sharp. And then I'm going to take this and I don't like the fronts to look drawn on so I'm just going to like do that like here so it kind of like diffuses the color and I feel like it looks perfect when I do that because it doesn't I don't know if you guys can tell like it really doesn't look drawn on they look very dark right now um but they don't look drawn they just look full I'm going to use this Clarins fix makeup I don't love it any more than I love any other facial mist I don't know like the Max Fix, Mac Fix Plus or whatever. I, I'm not. I don't know. Why. I always use my Rogue as my towel. I know it's gross, but I wash them all the time. <laughs> They're like big towels, so I don't understand. Like I remember my mom used to get so mad at me when I used to like wipe makeup all over towels. Like what? What is it supposed to do? I fucking do? You know? Like I don't know. Okay. Becca, shimmering skin. And I shared this in my last video, I think. And I'm just going to put it here like this. So gross, right? I'm not going to bring it past where I actually want it to be. I don't even know if this is how you're supposed to use it, but it works for me. So I'm going to take the back of my beauty blender and just kind of... A little bit of contour now, um, just on the nose, just a tiny bit. It just totally changes, changes the shape, it's so crazy. Take the beauty blender, towel, okay, and I'm just gonna like hit my nose. Okay, I'm gonna take this again and I'm just gonna swipe the top a little bit. A line that kind of okay then I'm gonna take the same thing my Kevin Aquan the, um, that was this one that I used for my nose and I'm gonna just give myself a little bit of a hollowed eye just seriously nothing just gonna do this I 
back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, because I do not want to do any kind of makeup stuff, honestly. It just gives me a good eye socket, because I have really flat eyes. Then, well, now I'm going to do um, just a little bit of, I'm not going to do anything other than some blush, I think. And this is my MAC Lazy Sunday. It's that cream one. And it's just like kind of gross now, but just it's really light and it doesn't like make me look so blushed out because I don't want that look. You guys know I kind of like it to look pale and like dead. Just I don't like to look like I have makeup on. Favorite winged liner, and this is my friend in um, Japan, or she's stationed there. Um, she sent me this dolly wink and i've always wanted to try it actually but i never bought it or i've never seen it around literally this is the best for what i do you guys know how i do that just a little like winged liner thing um it's so thin it's perfect it literally looks like a piece of hair Then just I'm gonna take this um, 104 by Rimmel in the Kate lipstick, and I'm just gonna wipe it on. And then wipe it off. actually Okay, so I just finished my makeup and I want to do this like get ready with me kind of like chill mellow like thing where I don't know I'm just like getting ready but my hair looks like disgusting sorry so um but whenever okay so this is the thing this is so embarrassing and I wanted to clar clarify this because I just filmed my bit the video but I was like I need to explain to them like what is going on so when I do my makeup, I sit in front of my like patio door in my bedroom and my neighbors, I know they can hear me because like they always have their dog on like the patio and I know their door is open. I think they work from home because I think they're always home, but I get like stage fright because I don't want people like thinking like, what is she? I don't know. I don't know why I care. I just feel like really awkward. Plus another thing is that I feel like they know so much about my life because I'm not quiet. I have the doors open all the time, like the wind, or like, you know, like the patio doors open all the time. Um, and I, it's like, I never hear anything about them. Like I'm always trying to like eavesdrop because it's like, how come there's like two people living in there, like a couple, and they never like talk or fight. Like what is going on? It's so weird to me. Like literally they never talk or fight. It's very strange. And I, like, I'm constantly like yelling or like I'm on the phone or like, like my, I have like TV on. Like I, like I know they can hear me because I can hear other people sometimes, but not them. So I get like stage fright when I know they can hear me like making a video because it's, it's probably thinking like, who the fuck is she talking to? Or like, what is she like? It's, I don't know. I just feel like ugh, I just get stage, stage fright. And it's, honestly, it's really annoying. It's like, I don't know. It, it's a really annoying thing to me that I have to, oh yeah. And then people are always like, well, just close your doors. I can't close my door because I can't, whenever I close the doors 
the doors have like a tint over them, so like a gray tint. So I feel like it gives me a gray look. Um, but I'm going to see. We'll see once I upload this because right now the doors are closed. And then when I was doing my makeup, the doors are open. Uh, so that's my, I just want to explain to you guys like why I was probably acting like I had stage fright in my, when I was getting ready. <laughs> I don't know. It's just like, I was just like, oh, and this is my makeup brush. <laughs> I'm kidding. I don't know. It's just weird. Anyway, um, so today I am going to, oh my gosh, sounds like a good, today I'm going to the mall. I have like some things I have to do. Um, honestly, I should not be taking off today at all. I really can't, but, um, I need to. And whenever I have like, I need to do something like this, it's just like, I find, I like justify it, even though I have zero time taking off work right now. I'll be working Saturday too. Um, so I'll make up for it. Um, and then... Monday is Labor Day, so our office building is closed on Monday. Not that we, I want to close the office. It's the building that's closed. Like, the manager closes the building for certain days, and they, like, lock you out, which I think is ridiculous. Like, I can't be taking that day off, and, like, I don't, like, whatever. We need to work, and, like, Ashley and I are, like, like, we would work. Like, we need to work, but we can't. Am I, is my voice, like, crack, cracky? I don't know. I'm, like, a mess today. I'm, like, high strung right now. Freaking annoying calic. <sighs> Here's my Orion's belt in silver. I'll probably wear this today. I always wear it. It's just like that little hint of sparkle. Um. Yeah, like, okay, another thing you guys about my neighbors. I don't know why I'm such a hater. I'm not, I'm not hating my neighbors. I just, I don't even know them. Oh, I, like, um. Okay, I know I'm loud as fuck with my rabbits. I'm like crazy and I'm like, oh my god, you know what I mean? Like always talking to them and like crazy, you know what I mean? I know I am. Like I'm like Elmira. I, I know it. Never, they never fucking talk to that dog. Like, I feel like it's okay. Another thing that's so funny. I was eating, I had like made steak a week ago, like, and then I don't eat certain parts of the steak if it gets like, if it's too done, I don't like it. I get, get disgusted. I get grossed out. It's like beef jerky, you know, if I cook the ends too much or something. And the poor dog is like sitting on like, you know, the patio alone. It's like this huge like, dog. And the patio is not big. It's probably like this big, you know? Um, and he was just like, like, I gave him a piece of the, I gave him meat, you know what I mean? Like, I don't, I mean, I don't understand people work. I get it, even though it was like nighttime. But, like, how come they're never talking to that dog? Like, I never hear them, like, talking to the dog. I see how I'm like talking low, because I'm like, just, like, I don't know why they, like, I get like nervous for my neighbors. I don't know. I'm, weird. I'm not good with people. You guys know that. Okay. My hair, yes, I cut it, and I just had my mom just, like, cut the end. So, you guys, don't wait, like, I know I'm not, I'm not dissing any hairstylists out there. I'm just saying, like, if it's, like, a long, if it's a long, if it's just like this, like, chop, just, like, have your friend, like, cut your hair. I, it's, not, it's not the money. It's me having to, like, schedule out the time to get my hair done. It's literally, like, I just don't have time for that. Oh, the back's like a fucking red train wreck. I actually don't hate it right now. I actually don't really hate it except I just feel like I can have like a couple pieces done, I guess. I do front and back, just so you guys know. Um, Um, okay, literally every little thing is irritating me right now. This is not good. Sorry for the water. You know what I mean? You know, like, you guys know, I don't know. I'm just very irrita irritable right now. Seriously, can you stop being so annoying? Stupid curling iron. It's like the cord is getting stuck on everything it possibly can start the cord just got stuck on a, on a hand lotion like like why like okay thank you so much for being so annoying i'm creep i'm creep crazy creep i know oh my gosh deciding what to wear next that is gonna be so fun <laughs> watch me just like get so over it i just end up putting the pants on no Oh, I watched the movie Camille last night for the first time with um, Greta Garbo. 
new eyes need to see that movie I'm sure a lot of you have but if you haven't you need to see it because you need to get even more unrealistic expectations of how men should be <laughs> for real though um yeah it's amazing it's a good movie it's a really good movie and you know it has like the prince charming kind of guy in it that everyone is like very attractive and so in love it's great I liked it. I liked it a lot. And then I watched, um, yeah, t cause yesterday I just like got home kind of early. I got home at like six, I think. Um, and I watched that and I watched The Man Who Came to Dinner. I've seen that before with Betty Davis. And I like that movie. I just, um, I like it. I like that movie. Um, but I prefer when Betty Davis plays like different, like more like glam roles or just like different. I thought her, this, her role in this was very just like blah. Okay, is the back good? I'm asking you guys. Probably look like shit, I can't tell. Will it look okay? How creepy am I? I'm like talking to you like you're right here. You guys like it? Okay. Uh -huh. All right, on to the next. Get ready now. I feel like my part is a little bit off. And then I'm thinking about going to Fashion Week this year. I'm not sure. I got invited a couple of things. Like, I mean, I don't like going. You guys. Honestly, I don't like going because it's just kind of annoying. Like, honestly, it's kind of annoying because the same people over and over get invited to, like, those amazing shows. Like, I'm not talking about, like, amazing people like Brian Boy and, like, you know, like big time, like, fashion people. I'm talking about, like, People that have, you know, PR companies that, like, pay, you know, you pay them to, like, rep you and, like, get you, like, gigs. Like, bitch, the only reason you're even invited to that is because your fucking mom or whatever paid for your PR person. Literally. Like, it's the only reason you're anything. So, I don't even know how I got invited to, like, little things, which I'm totally, like, I'm cool with that. Like, that is, I don't even know how I get invited to stuff because I don't know how they find me, but I got invited to some things. And I think it'll be fun to go, but I'm just like, it's like right now. It's like starting next week, so I have to make a decision. Um, and I'm not like invited to a, as many things as I would like to be invited to to go, because obviously I pay for like my way to go. I'm not being paid by anyone. Or no one will pay, no one, you know what I mean? I'm not being, whatever. Now, what's the word? I don't even fucking know what the word is. Okay. Um, this is Surf's Up Texture Spray, and I got this from Urban. Um, and then I saw a girl, the girl who does Chiara Ferragiani's, whatever, her makeup, she lives here in LA, um, I forgot what her name, her name is, her name is like Nikki or something. What do you guys think? Ferragamo, Rag and Bone, Zara T. Ugh, I don't know, I was thinking of this, or, I don't know, I could wear my Stella's, I just think these, then, I don't know. Ew, oh my god, these make me feel like I have cankles with these fucking pants. Oh my god. Did they? Look at, can you guys tell? I have cankles with these. Oh my god, what in the world? I hate these jeans. It's the jeans. It's definitely the jeans, because I've never had a problem with these shoes before. Either of these shoes. Oh my god, these are like the worst jeans ever. It's not hot. I would just like kind of like bring this, you know what I mean? It's because it all or also just like a white shirt. Mm -hmm. That's gross. Just like not my body's not good for low rise. I feel like it makes me look like I don't know. Okay, these are the Zara ones, and I don't love them at all, actually, because they're really thick. Um, I feel like the Topshop ones are really good because they're thin, so they don't add bulk to you, but at least these are higher. And then I ripped this open, 
thinking that it was on the knee, but it's not. It's on the thigh, and now my fat thigh is, like, bulging through. So that was a mistake, because it was, like, sealed. And then I thought it was, like, on the knee, but it's not. I can like see a roll coming through, which is really, really attractive. Oh my god, these are like okay. First of all, this mirror in my room literally adds ten pounds. I swear. Just really wanted to not wear the same jeans over and over. Really wanted that, but you know. can't. So, guess I'm back to the top shops. Actually, I kind of like the belt. I think it kind of like ties it together a little bit. What do you think? Are we, are we digging this outfit? Is this better? You guys are probably like, Alex, is this seriously the same thing you put on four times? And it is, but it's really not because this one looks good and the other ones didn't. Okay. To add like different textures. I feel like this is kind of cute. I feel like this could kind of work. This is why I don't get ready, you guys. This is why I just wear your pants because it's too much effect and effort. Like I do. So oh, I'm gonna start with the Orion's belts. Here's my little pouch. I literally keep this with me in my bag because I like like to change jewelry around depending on like my mood or what I want to do, but. Out. This is the bag that, um, it's a big bag. It's the bag that, like, complicated, um, jewelry, complicated chains, and crystals come in here. Okay, so, obviously, I always start out with Orion and Lariat, but I'm, like, trying to switch it up today, you guys. I'm like kind of, honestly, I'm kind of bummed on myself that I wasn't able to find something different to wear. This is why it's, like, why am I going to the mall, like, why am I going to the mall when I don't wear anything else other than yoga pants? I'm just not buying anything today. Just not. I'm just going to do my errand and then I'm leaving. Look at that. And then, I mean, the lasso is like a given. I feel like I'm always wearing, I was like, just throw and go. A lot. If you're just like a throw and girl, go, go. If you're a throw and go person, you just like put it on. You know what I mean? But I don't know. I like always wear that. I'm trying to switch it up. Okay, here's the delicate bones. I can just do that, but it's a little bit too like delicate, delicate, delicate. Okay. Delicate bones. Seamless. So that you don't have to deal with clasps because I just you guys know well, I'm I just not a clasp person. I clasp, um, I just don't like that. that's kind of pretty though. I love the way it's just like little sparkles of like it looks like I have like strands of diamonds on myself even though it's just like shimmering chains kind of gorge okay um I just feel like I I don't know I feel like I need something else I wanted to wear something thicker I could wear my um Lux Cube but I don't know if that will like take away from I feel like it's almost the same. Yeah. It's like all too delicate now. That's why I wanted to wear something like mix it in. Like Lux rounded cube. No, so this is how it looks right oval. That's pretty. Love that. Coronation. Oh, what about that? Is that a little bit too much? So we'll cover. I'll probably cover up too much though, but I kind of like like the layering thing of it because you can just like see peaks. This little like combo literally just made my day. Okay, I have to show you guys this another light. I just feel so much better now. <laughs> I was like feeling so like not normal, but just like I Alex, like you never wear anything different. You always wear the same thing, but I just feel like this just made my mood so much better. I oh my gosh, look at that. Okay, let me just tell you what I'm wearing, but I don't know if you can even see. So the coronation landed right on top. So I kind of like, because obviously I make the jewelry for myself, <laughs> I can um, shorten it or lengthen it to like layer the way I want it to. Like if I want two coronation chokers, I can like make one a little bit smaller. You know what I mean? Um, that's just like 
the beauty of having it online because you can do what you want. But so with this one, I have it layered so that it hits on my uh, sleek dash lariat. So it just like sits on it. So almost like it looks like it's connected. And then I have the Orion. This is the Orion in silver, the delicate bones, um, yeah, and the coronation. And so then this almost just looks like it's just a, I like it because it looks very, I just feel like it looks, it almost looks like it's tattooed on my chest. Like this piece is like almost, you know those flash tattoos? It just looks like everything is tattooed because it's so delicate, so shiny. Um, I just, oh my gosh, like I, okay, now I'm like, st now I'm happy, Alex, because everything came together. I want to show you guys the whole look, though. I'm um, still trying to decide. Look at how my mood just changed. I'm nuts. Um, what about perfume? I don't like that one. I should never have gotten that perfume. I love this. This I love this one. I'm just going to, I don't really, I don't know if I feel like this today. What do I feel like? Blanche, no. Bad memories. Gypsy water. I kind of feel like gypsy water today, I think. Mojave Ghost. I haven't worn that in a long time. Ooh. Mm, no. Okay. I think I'm going to do gypsy water, which is like so basic, bitch, as far as like HRH goes. This is like the first one that I got. But. Okay, now I'm kind of feeling on, you guys. These are Dita, but I'm not really feeling these right now. Hmm. Dior. It's a little bit like too much right now. I feel like I'm just getting to be like too much. Actually, I think I'm gonna wear the acne ones I always wear. They're in my car. I got these like when I went to go visit Shanghai like three years ago. I got these when I was there. And, um, I was, like, the first one in the entire world to have these. No, I'm kidding. Um, but, probably. <laughs> I'm kidding. So, I love these. I'll never give these up because I got them in Shanghai and they're designer items. So, they just, like, remind me of amazing experience. Okay, and then, I don't even know. It's kind of cute, this outfit, though. But I feel like these are kind of getting outdated, played out. I've seen, like, multiple people wearing these now. Okay, um... down. Oh yes, it's much better lighting, isn't it, you guys? Okay, here is my jewelry. Coronation Rope Choker, Sleek Dash Lariat, Orion in the uh, silver, and this is this uh, Delicate Bones. <sighs> so pretty, right? Okay, actually I'm loving, you know what it was? That lighting in my bedroom is absolutely freaking atrocious. So I think I was like in a bad mood because ugh, you guys, that lighting is really bad in there. It's like gray and then I have to turn on a light so it's like orange then afterwards. Anyway, that's it. I hope you guys like this video. Um, I thought it was kind of fun. I don't know how I'm going to edit this because I've literally had this on for an hour. But yeah, okay. <laughs> I love you guys and have a great week. Okay.